I'm in the Bracken Beacons. Friday afternoon. Beautiful day. It's got to be 16 degrees. And I think it's going to get down to 4, 3 degrees tonight. And what I'm going to do is walk up the Gap Road. The Roman Road, as they also call it. And I'm going to take a hike up to Cribbin, which is... There, 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 by there. Take a hike up to the summit. Do a summit camp tonight. Well, that's the plan anyway. We'll see what, what happens when we get up there. If I can find somewhere flat, suitable to pitch a tent. So yeah, hopefully get a decent sunset, decent sunrise in the morning. Well, that's what we do it really, isn't it? You know, for the amazing views. So right. Let's get a move on. Right, I'll just show you where I've come from. I pan round. Follow my finger all the way down the path, down to the tree line. That's where the van is parked down there. Right the way down there in the distance. Made my way up the gap road. And you come to this junction. You can either turn right to go to Vanna Beag or left. So I go up cribbing and that's the way I'm going now. Right, if I pan round, I'm going up there, then just follow the ridge around and there's a the summit by there. So that's hopefully where I'll be camping tonight. Oh, I'll see another Half hour, we'll be there. Made it onto the summit of Cribbin. That's it up there, the pile of stones. But have a look at this. What a view, what a view that is. Absolutely amazing. And we're going to have an awesome sunset up there around that area later on. So I'm going to set up a GoPro. Do a time lapse, see how that turns out. Amazing. And not much wind either, to be honest. Which I'm quite surprised about. Right, so the next thing I'm going to do, try and find somewhere to pitch up for the night. By here looks pretty good. Fairly flat. But the only thing is, it's next to the main path. Because that path there goes down and back up to Penavan and Corn So if I pitch by here and a ranger comes up then I'm going to get moved on, simple as that. 
So what I'm thinking is, if I just head a bit further down from the summit, I saw a few uh, flat spots on the way up, so I might um, pitch up down there. It's not that far from the summit, so plus I'll get all the views. So yeah, really happy with that. Awesome. Right, that's a tent set up. It's not perfect, but look at that view. That more than makes up for it. Fantastic. Quickly show you my setup. I've got the usual Thermarest Neo Air X Therm inflatable pad. I've got the Trichology a left 2.0 pillow and got the OEX Leviathan Four Season down bag. So that should be plenty warm enough for tonight. And for food tonight I've got an Expedition Food Beef Shepherd's Pie endorsed by Sir Ranulph Fines. <laughs> got some pepperamis, chocolate bars and as usual a couple of cans of the Herefordshire fire water. Put the water in, give it a stir, sealed it up. I'll give that about 10 minutes and I'll give you my verdict on it. Never had it before. First time for me and I'll let you know what it's like. Whilst my food is um, rehydrating, have a look at this. Camera never does it justice, but really happy up here, really happy. Summit of Cribbing up there, Penavan, Corndy. Just had a couple of mouthfuls of this, I've got to be fair. I'd give that 7 out of 10. That's pretty good. Yeah, very nice. I had my food earlier and two cans. I put my head down, I just fell asleep. <laughs> and my phone, my ringer was on off my on my phone, so I woke up to about 20 missed calls. And they were all worried about me. <laughs> Where are you? You haven't been abducted by aliens, have you and all this rubbish? Like, I just genuinely fell asleep, I'm bloody knackered. So, um, it's quite a tough walk um, hiking up here from the car park, like, so. So, yeah, just. 
eight o'clock, I was zonked out. It's one of those things, I suppose. Anyway, now I'm awake, I'll have another couple of cans. And I'll see you in the morning. morning. I think I had seven hours sleep last night. Pretty decent. But it was windy. Bloody hell. Oh. It's nuts, right? I don't know if you can see him. But Penavan. There's loads of people up there just come up for the sun sunrise. They're all here for one thing. This. <laughs> Tell you what, I'm gonna show you something. I said yesterday I forgot my GoPro connector to go on the tripod. So I've had to do a bit of imp improvisation. Got a GoPro there, sat on a rock, and I put a rock either side of it to stop it moving. So, yeah, that's the sort of thing you gotta do when you're out in the wilds. A bit parky as well. Gonna try and make a cup of coffee now. It is blowing a gale. But I'll give it a go.
I think it's time to pack up. The wind hasn't stopped. And it's wearing me down a little bit. Anyway, I've had a coffee. I'll start packing down now and start heading out of here. That's me all packed up. The usual leave those race. That's where the tent was. So I'm gonna head that way now, back off the mountain, back off the wind, and hopefully it's a bit better down the bottom.